Hi, welcome back to my final morning report. Charts appraisal on Wednesday, the second of September, with me, which Premier Market Analyst at Handset Markets. Let's look at gold, and we're still seeing this gold price drifting higher. Um, fairly benign-looking momentum indicators, actually. Now you've got the RSI that's just tr again drifting higher. Stochastics fairly, fairly neutral. MACD line is also fairly neutral. So there is this drift that we've got going on. I don't necessarily think it's going to, I think it's going to be more of a near term basis. I still think that we're in a, a longer term sort of bearish outlook on gold. Um, let's draw in this downtrend that actually comes in pretty pretty well actually there um, on this chart. So you've still got this sort of downtrend phase over the last few months and it's just rewound, uh, sorry, unwound back towards that downtrend. I think ultimately that's going to continue to play out. You've got these falling moving averages as well on the longer term basis. And what we have as I said, is this a slight drift higher over the past few days. There's no reason to really not go with that drift at the moment. You've had a, a pretty decent move uh, in, the, in the last couple of days. Interestingly, because I talked about yesterday that uh, on a near-term basis that the support came in around 11, sort of 35, 11.36, and yes, that's pretty much where yesterday's low hit before we started to rally again. Um, overnight so that that is your initial support and I think until you see a breakdown at 11 25 50 level uh, which is that reaction low from Friday uh, sorry Monday I think you'd still be in a reasonably positive mindset on this gold chart nothing uh, it doesn't look as though it's going to be sort of bursting higher at any stage I think it's fairly fairly um, sort of quiet and settled and sort of just s quietly get coming back probably back towards maybe even back towards that um, downtrend again which currently comes in around 1160 so um, it looks as though this is sort of quite a calm period of trading for gold at the moment and um, maybe a few gains can be got out of that but uh, certainly little short-term positions buying to these little ra um, corrections um, for a, a move higher back towards the resistance testing yesterday's high 47.20 and uh, it certainly looks to be, certainly on this chart, that is um, sort of the old su uh, support of the neckline, became resistance on that rebound, and again, that's resistance there. So that is your near-term resistance you need to look out for. But I wish you good luck in your trading on gold today, and I'll speak to you later. Thank you.